Hello, my name is Jared Spiker, and this is my first attempt at making an internet video. I sound like an old person, internet video. I just don't like the word vlog. Uh, but, alright, why am I doing this? Uh, about three months ago, I think it was on February, Alex Day uploaded a video where he said, uh, if you're a person who makes videos for himself, and if you're in on YouTube, you should be. And that really got me thinking. I'm a person on YouTube and I don't make videos for myself. Why is that? So I really got to thinking about it, and I thought, well, maybe it's just because I don't have anything interesting to say. I'm not entirely sure that that is true. Like, a lot of video bloggers will just kind of speak their mind about random stuff. It's not necessarily interesting stuff, just they're conveying it with enthusiasm, and I seem to like that, and a lot of other people seem to, so I don't know if that's a reason not to do it. Then I thought, well, maybe it's just because I don't have any talents that convert well to, uh, to video. And I'm also not sure about that. Because, just using Alex Day for an example, and I think he's a fantastically talented individual, but his channel is him talking about things and his music. And if it was just his music, I would not watch his channel. I think it's great music and it's very enjoyable, but I watch it, I watch his channel because of him and him talking about just the things that are going on in his life, and I don't know why that's interesting, but apparently it is. Uh, it's occurring to me now that maybe it's because he has a cool accent, so he can tell me things. It just sounds nice, and I don't have that, so maybe this is due from the beginning, but I guess we'll see. So, about me. Uh, my name is Jared Spiker. I am from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, which is a place where a, a, a suspicious amount of internet users seem to be from. Especially if you're on Reddit, there's always one comment on a thread that has something to do with being from Calgary, and then you upvote it, like, oh, so am I, and for some reason, it's always there, I don't know why, it's, I don't see it for any other city. Maybe it's because the other ones just aren't, like, vain enough to need to confirm that they are present. Uh, I am a curler, I teach curling, and I play it recreationally. Uh, I am a student in computer science at the University of Calgary. Uh, and a student of really all of the sciences on my own time. I don't think there's any field of science where I'm not, I'm not very interested in. But those are kind of the generic answers, right? Like, when you ask someone about their self, themselves, they always tell you, like, what sport they play, and what they study, or what they do for their work. I really got thinking about how I answer that question. Like, you know, who are you? What do you do? Uh, when, when I started thinking about this video. And I realized that you don't really learn anything about a person from that. Like, everyone just has their own generic answer that they give. I really don't know why that is. It's not like I don't want people to know about me, but it's almost like I don't know what's interesting about myself. And I find that a lot of other people seem to have this problem, too. So, what do I find interesting about myself? Uh, I am a writer. That is what people would call my passion. It is what I spend a lot of my free time doing. I write sci-fi and fantasy. And... I hope one day that other people will get to enjoy the things I write, other than, you know, just myself. I enjoy the process, but I hope people can enjoy the product of it. Other than that, though, I'm really not sure within the context of this video, mostly because I have no idea where this is going. Uh, this is, I made this because I was thinking about why I don't make videos, and just, you got to start somewhere, but I don't know where it's going to go from here. You know, there are the obvious ideas, like, I like talking about things that matter to me, obviously, but that's, everyone can do that. Uh, you know, I like debating things with people, but that's hard when you don't have anyone to debate things with. Like, I don't want to do it with someone I know. Uh, so that would require people to actually know about this, which is not the case at the moment. I love conveying ideas, like, I like educating but I don't think I'm very good at it, so I don't think that can be a focus of these videos. Uh, I like reviewing things. I like all, Everyone likes sharing their opinions on something. But I'm not... The thing, the obvious choice is books, because I love books, I like writing, but I'm a slow reader, so that's not sustainable. But one thing you might find out about me, here's something about myself. I am stubborn. If I get my heart set on something, I will do it until... The ends, of the, the ends of the world, until I am satisfied with the final product. And so in this context, I don't know if that means doing it until people want to watch these, or just doing it until I feel like I've run out of things to say. Probably the latter, but we will see. 
But for now, I'm just a guy with uh, a laptop camera and a laptop microphone. And I did listen to the audio of one of those clips before before recording this one, and I apologize for how much it seems like an airplane is flying through my house right at the moment. Um, but I am uh, not going to go out and buy equipment for something that I don't know is going to work or not. That would be dumb. So you're just going to have to bear with me for, for, for a little bit, just a little bit. I also have no idea about... You hear people talking about lighting. Uh, I have no idea how that works. I guess I could, I could experiment with something. Maybe if I open this, these blinds. Oh god, no. I guess now I could convey my stories as an anonymous drug user, but no one wants to hear that. Actually, some people probably would, but I'm not an anonymous drug user. I'm neither anonymous nor a drug user, so I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Also, I'm probably not looking at the camera all that much because my eyes are drawn to the, the, the me on my screen while I'm filming this. Maybe a good idea would just be to not have that open here. Let's try that. Oh, that's so much easier. But there's something about talking to a camera that's strange and I'm not used to. It's so much easier just to talk to a picture of myself. And now everyone thinks I'm crazy. Oh, I can't stop it from recording if it's not over. This is clearly a learning process. So, my intention is to upload this to YouTube. If anyone ever actually ends up watching this, I hate to seem like the person who's like, oh, no one's gonna watch this, what's the point? But, seriously, if you've gotten to this point, you can understand why people wouldn't want to watch this. But, since you have, since you know you're listening to this, thank you. I'll try and do more of these. I don't know how I'd ever promote it, but we'll, we'll see where this goes. Thanks for watching. And hopefully I can give you something more interesting next time. Bye. It is occurring to me now that the name of this YouTube channel, that the name of the YouTube channel that this will be uploaded to won't be Jared Spiker, uh, because that's the name of the actual YouTube channel I watch. Actual YouTube videos. Well, I guess this is an actual YouTube video. You know what I mean. That's the name of Jared Spiker's the name of that channel. So I'll upload this one to. I'm not gonna name it J D Spiker. We'll call it that. It's that. Those are the initials I go by. So I'm not gonna lie about my name, but if you're wondering, I'm not gonna upload it to the channel I watch actual YouTube videos on because you don't need to know every time I like something. I hate that. It's dumb. But that's YouTube's fault. But anyway.